Ladies and gentlemen on YouTube, welcome back to my channel. This is the actual start of a farm. We're going to be playing on this farm as long as the game doesn't get lost between beta and actual um, release. This is going to be my farm. I don't want to go to Ravenport. I want to go to the this other map. The most snow we've had. I know, it's snowing. We're going to Felsbrunn. I love snow. There's my character. What are, what are the boys? Hat. Why do the girls look like? The same as they did last time. There's like four or five different girls you can pick from now, though, Goose. Can I see them? No, but give me five because you're cute. I want to see What's them. up, Bin Pin? I'm glad Show to be them. back, too. Gaming Nerfer. Hey, what's up, friend? <gasps> Gaming Nerfer. Ethan, hi. <laughs> Hello, Ethan. That's that's goosey. Wahoo! What's up, M Madness? Ep Madness? Call, the, call me Violet. Man, Mustang Man, call you Violet. Oh, she doesn't like goosey. Fine, she's Violet. Uh, this is the first time I've been on this map, so it'll be fun. Just watching me on YouTube. Yeah. So here's a question: Do you think I should post those things that we did this morning on YouTube? Ah. Oh. Look at this, guys. Did someone say bacon? What's up? That's okay. That's really loud. Hey, what's up, Big Wayne? Real trucker. I'm doing great. Okay, so we are gonna start our own farm. So we're kind of done with the. Uh, you said give me your p. Oh, please ban me from Fortnite, please. You said you're back in your second again. <laughs> well, you're like seventh or eighth. <laughs> uh, I'm really enjoying it. So uh, we're gonna start our own farm. Now look at this though. This is something that I did not see in the American map. We actually have a pad. And it's all marked with equipment, like on the map, but there's nothing here. One creepy boil, hello. Uh, so once again, we're done with the equipment. Uh, no, we're all done. We're done with the question and answer. I did that for like eight hours today. <laughs> we're actually starting a farm, and we're going to play t on this one. So sorry about that. But if you want to see cotton, I do have a video up on my channel um, that is available to see it. But look at here. So we have this pad now that where we can put our farm down. So I do have a lot of cotton harvesting that we did a bunch. So... You just finished watching all the videos. There we go. Yes. So, uh, ready to see some Me Too Crusher of Doom. That's such a dark name. <laughs> Crusher of Doom. But we're going to poke around the map a little bit and see what else we can see. I don't know. This might be the only pad, and this is definitely going to be where we set up farm, obviously, because this is perfect for, well, setting up farm. Uh, let's take a look at the map. Once again, I have not been on this map at all. I really like it already. It's, it's very beautiful. So, we're in the European map. This is Feldsbrunn. Looks like all the fields are bunched together. The layout's kind of similar to the other map, um, with the, s the coast being to the south rather than to the north or west. Um, oh, that's cool. <laughs> One creepy boil. <laughs> you, want, you watch what you want to get more greedy. <laughs> Eventually we will do cotton, but cotton seems like it's kind of a long... I mean, it pays well. Um, the DLC has taken kings. That's so funny. All right, so, yeah, it is really, really, really different. Um, I guess it is the same graphics engine, but, man, does it look good. They did great. I don't see the shop on my map. Hmm. Well, we're, we'll fix that. What we're going to do is this. Um, we're going to go to our – no, wrong button. I'm going to go this way. So I'm still debating whether I get um, a Mahindra – Mahindra. Can I say dingo in a dingo? Isn't it kind of the same dingo? <laughs> right now, I know it's so good. <laughs> it works now. You're good. All right. You need to upgrade your PS4. I think it'll still be. Uh, are you going to do a contract or two? Yes, we are going to be doing contracting and all that stuff tonight. This is going to be officially New Holland Farm. I've actually in all the the time that I've done branded farms. I've never, um, I've never done a New Holland Farm, which is my favorite brand. So we're gonna do it. But I'm trying to find Mahindra in alphabetical order, and still for some reason can't find it. So the retriever is seventeen thousand. Um, let's look at the lizard pickup. I just want to see price wise which one is gonna be better. Um. Jorgen. Sorry, the kids are in the background tonight, uh, and Ryan and Seth are leaving, so I'm going to be on my own, so there's going to be some serious noise. Okay, so this pickup is $30,000. Let's see, why isn't this a Stara New Holland farm? I, well, we're going to do Stara on um, Estancia La Pacha when it comes out, so uh, I did not give myself money on this map. This map is going to be done the old-fashioned way. 
we're on the middle setting and that's it so um get a new holland and make it john Deere green <laughs> i did not go over the ramp now and to me that's you know you know how you guys know how i am i could care less about doing jumps and stuff like that <laughs> yep this is the start of the single play i know i'm ex this is it um <laughs> he's totally excited <laughs> Taste Tolo. Or Taze Tolo? All right, so let's go ahead and kind of look around the map a little bit. Once again, I think this probably is the place that's specifically designed for you to set up. The game starts at 1.2 mil. That is correct. Um, John Deere is Ravenport. Yes, yeah, that's correct. We're going to do Ravenport, John Deere. The third setting is to have no money and no equipment. The first setting is to have a little farm. Thank you, Seth. Coffee. And some equipment. Coffee. We're going to keep going. That's right. So. Wait a minute. Aren't we where I just was? No. Okay, so the shop is just down the road. Perfect. I know. That's what I do. It, it happens a lot. So. Start at 500,000. Okay. That's the amount. I haven't tried that mode yet, so. Um, so let's just poke around a little bit and see what we see as far as like what other sites would be good for starting a farm. What's up, King Coda? Ooh, a PS4 copy early. Whoa. I mean, 500,000 is still okay, but you're going to have a really hard time. And you won't make as much money either, so. That'll be rough. Sorry to bring back FS19, but where is the grain cart in the purchase menu? Under tippers. Look, cow. The holy cow statue. There's the holy cow statue. This is probably not a good place to buy property for a home because we're right on the lake, so we're going to get out of here. I hope it works well, Beaverton. This kind of end, dead ends here. That one place looks like it's really made. Now, the downside is we're still going to have to buy a house to go there, so... No, I don't think there's anyone where you start with zero dollars. They've got to give you something to get um, to get into the cow. They got they have to give you something to get started with. So now I've got my I did turn my uh, joysticks on to zero, and there is definitely some play in my joystick. Shows I got cheap like twenty dollar joystick, so now kind of swing back and forth. Derek, yay! Well, this is good because we're starting on new farm. This is going to be the actual gameplay, so no more. Um, no, this is in Germany. They drive on the right in Germany. It's only England in in the UK and, and in Europe that you drive on the wrong left side of the road. <laughs> What's up, Osgly? Also, Australia and Japan. Whoops. Yes, my controller is working, though. It's i got to mess with it a little bit because I turned off the dead zones. I'm seeing I need a little bit of dead zone in there. Yeah, we had like 150 this, a this afternoon. We'll get more. What's up, Two Bay? All right, so once again, this is my first time on the Euro map. I just want to look around a little bit before we get totally started. Um, everyone's going to be sick of these maps by the time this is over. Ooh, look at that. What the heck is that? Oh, what? This is this is a little exciting. Look at that, man. There's like a... What? We could buy this. I mean, wait a minute. Oh, this is the shop. I got so excited and it was, it's the shop. I, yes. Oh, you start with a loan. Okay, this has a loan too. This has a $250,000 loan already taken out. So, yeah, me too. Me too, 44 Magnum. I don't know that it'll stay there, but it, it's going to go up for a bit anyway. So, this is the Feldsbrunn map. We are in Germany. Theoretically. Yeah, dang it. This is, I'm going to have to change the dead. Wait, what's unfortunate, you dog man? You have not much must. Uh, well, I, I streamed all day, Osgly, but you, you knew that. But this, I, we just started like two minutes ago, so you're fine. Um, yeah, I think we're just gonna start on that pad. Let's let's just let's get started. So I don't know what the max loan is yet, but it changes. So there's really no max loan. It depends on how much land you have. <laughs> when you rolled in with your gator. <laughs> yeah, that's the shot. Oh, that the shot. Oh, yeah, right. Okay. <laughs> I 
just got to watch. Yeah, I'm going to have to put the dead zone a little bit back on my steering joystick. Everything else is fine, the view and everything, but the, my steering joystick obviously has a little play in it, so. It <laughs> came <Gaming> river. <laughs> All right, so let's start by putting a farm together. Just the basics, just the basics. Mostly we're going to be parking our equipment outside to start with because, well... Money, buildings are money and we need to put our money into uh, equipment what we're going to need at least a harvester and a tipper and um and a uh, har and a uh, tractor so um but yeah i love it i love that we can drive to it and see it yep so this is the good place this is really set up for this you know so we're going to put the house right here we're definitely going to do horses They have the little side-by-sides in the game. They're integral part of the farms these days. Yes. Yeah, I do wish it was looked as good on Twitch. And it actually looks even better in real life. So, um, why can't I shut this off? Oh, we're in a new game. I forgot. I need to change some settings. Um, so, we're going to do that real quick here. I want this off, 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 off. I want stop and go breaking on. And I want automatic engine start off. There we go. Good. Okay, uh, we will do chickens at some point, yes. The gauge on the vehicle measuring, I have probably speed. That's the speed. And it's on, oh, that's the other thing we need to change too. Thank you for pointing that out. Unfortunately, this doesn't save changes between maps, so we need to go back to kilometers and euros because we're in Europe. We'll have to switch that back and forth. Save the game and go back. So let's go ahead and place a house. I just finished watching part five of the sneak peek and I spelled it wrong. Yes. <laughs> uh, we had a couple hour break this afternoon. I'm sick. And so I just kind of pooped out. Yeah. So this is the Mahindra. And uh, so that's it. And so let's go ahead into the shop. It's a little cheaper than the John Deere and it's a lot cheaper than the pickup. So eventually I would like to get that, but I think the farmhouse is super important because that's how we sleep and live. And I want to put it, let's see. Oh, I don't own the land yet. <laughs> okay, so we got to go into the map <laughs> and buy the land. It comes with a field, so that's good Good bananas. $200,000. Wow. Okay. Yes. But I think this is the best spot. You could do it anywhere you want, but I think this is the best spot to do it. So that leaves us with about a million. What do we do? Should we get this too? This would leave us with 800,000. Oh man. I think we're going to buy everything first and then see if, uh, yeah, derp. <laughs> uh, and then see what else we can afford. Uh, so details, because I, I really like to get the horse thing. And with the horse thing, we'd be able to get, supposedly they're, the horses are worth a lot. So we're going to put the house, we've got some grass too. That's actually pretty good. So I think we're going to actually build on the pavement because the house Mm, maybe right here. This would be a good spot for it. I don't want to waste any free land. Let's see. How do we... i got to figure out how to rotate this. Just like that. Okay. And a little bit more. It needs to rotate a little more. It's weird. It moves when I rotate it, but... Spin it the other way. You think so? Where's the front of the house? The front of the house. I want the front of the house to be facing the parking lot. Let's do it. There we go. Right about there. Ta-da. Only one item per farm. Oh, so weird. It's only one house per farm. Interesting. Yep, just like that. Perfect. And it's got furniture. And now we're going to buy the dog house because I do want a dog. What's up, Cynical Penguin? So we're doing it for real this time. Animal pens. We got it. Farmhouses, silos. It is snowing like gangbusters outside, man. It is crazy. You said it's backwards. There's no such thing as backwards, my friend. I want the front of the house looking out. Like we got the porch looking over the yard. And then the front of the house is looking out towards the fields, which is good. That's how I wanted it. There's the dog house. Well, build your own dang farm. 
<laughs> okay, and then uh, we're gonna also get the horsey pen. We got six hundred ninety-eight thousand. Oh my gosh, this is going. The money is going fast. <sighs> How much is a horse pen? Mm-hmm. Horse paddock. Oh, expensive, but not as bad as I thought. Hey, what's up, man? Count train. Hello, what's going on? Arf arf. Hey, everybody's coming in. Farmer Bernie. Man, wow, everybody right too soon. <laughs> Puppies. Let's see. We're gonna get that. All right. So. There we go. And the paddock is going to go. That's going to eat up. I don't want to eat up any field space. Yes, that JC is correct. Um, join us. Join the dog side. Um, that looks good, but I'm not sure about the orientation. Let's see. Yeah, no, that'll work because the food's right up front. And then the, the paddock door is on the other side. And there's a paddock door on this side. Oh, 2 a.m. work. Ooh. No, we're doing horses. The chickens are not going to make any money, Logo. I mean, I get it. I want to see all the different animals, too. But the chickens are going to be... The chickens don't make much money. We need money. Um, so the next thing that we're going to do... We have a couple things that we need to buy. What's up? What? Uh, Weiden, or Weidenbach, thank you for hosting. Um, all right, so... Let's see. You say start with chicken. See, Killer wants to do chickens too. I'm sorry, guys. I want to do the horses simply because the horses are going to make a lot of money. Though we have to ride them, so that's going to stink. But fed oats. Yes. That's all they eat is oats. Well, we'll probably grow oats on our field, so that way we can do it both. So I need I need Star Wars too. Star Wars? <laughs> straw. Oh, straw. So they do need straw? Okay. All right. Yes, there is interior lighting, Snoop Dogg. Um, yes, they do. The tractors do light up at night, and you have lighting, so it's pretty cool. Okay, so we're gonna hold off there, and we're gonna buy some equipment. The things that we need for our our farm right now, we definitely need a harvester to work for other people. I'm not buying that bison. That's just silly. Um, what is the difference here? This has 4,500. That's 5,600. That's 180 horsepower. I think we're going to go with the New Holland. Um, so let's see what we got available. That is just bought as is. We have It's $100,000. That's really actually not that bad for a harvester, honestly. Uh, we will need to get um, a header trailer. And we're going to, so we're going to grab that. Oh, it's got its own header trailer that's matching. Cool. All right. Well, hello, Mike. You guys are here on the start of my first farm in Farm Sim 17. We're going to have some fun and slowly build this farm up. Uh, we've done a lot of touring, but now it's time to get serious. The only thing I don't like about winter is, uh, this, yeah, well, this is New Holland Farm. The thing I don't like about the snow is it's quiet. And there's like no, oh, I love that. It, there's like no yeah, the sample Rosenlou is yeah. gone. There's like no noise outside besides like a little wind, and it's really creepy. Let's see. The upgrade didn't go as easy as it should have. <laughs> um, yeah. Farm Sim 19. That's the creepiest part about winter. Is it's always just like really sad. Yes, Osgly, you're watching history be made. All right, so we're going to go for a T6 160. We have $512,000. Do we want to go bigger? No, because we still have a bunch of stuff we need to get. So we're going to buy that. Um, I want to go with the, the wider tires. There we go. I know, and then eventually we're going to need to be able to work on these, but uh, how much can we cram under the Fiat? <laughs> Sweet. There you go, Andrew. You're going to be flying. Let's see. So we're going to go for the top horsepower option, which is 175, right? Yeah, that's worth it. Uh, no, there will be no multiplayer tomorrow night. Front loader attacher, yes, and because we're probably going to need to get a front loader and all that stuff. Um That you have to deliver grain. Right. Oh, we're going to get a tipper and all that stuff. I'm working on that. five star my back. No, I didn't. He, what? I had you with two fingers. Yeah, that freaking hurt, dude. <laughs> get out of here. Yeah, there's a lot of snow going on right now in real life. Okay, so we're going to get two. Let's see. Let's take a look at the tippers. Yes, Ryan, what do you want? That That's a gorgeous telly. It's, uh, it's, it's not the color you like, though. Actual M&M, though. Sweet. And he's upgraded it. Better American parts. 
without ray tracing. <laughs> so does it really make that much difference, huh? That's cool. So we're gonna get a for it. Do we need a bale? Yeah, we're going to need the bale loading wagon because we need to move both bales and we need to move seed bags and stuff like that when we get into that. So we'll get this. This is not bad at 8000 bucks. Um, should we just go for the small tires? South Park, no snow yet. Thank you for that. Bling. That's so funny. Uh, all right, so no snow in southern Ohio, huh? So do we do the little lizard wheels? If I do the lizard wheels, I wonder if the... No, we're just going to do this. Just go... The... Can you shut my door, Ryan? There's too much noise. That's not a bad deal, dude. Daddy. All right, so uh, let's see here. Um, Daddy. Daddy. This map looks way cooler than Raven Report. Yeah, it's a little more realistic. Evelyn, what? What? No, I'm not going to the store. It's a blizzard, and my car isn't running well. We're not going out of the house. <laughs> what happened? Did oh the stream went down? Oh, weird. Hang on, guys. Oh no. <laughs> so still the same still the same what <laughs> all right so i don't know what happened there i restarted the router it still wasn't working i shut down and restarted obs twice and finally the second time i start restarted obs it started working again so here we go uh, we're gonna buy this let's take a look at what we got so far because now i'm all i'm all discombobulated i don't remember where we were so Got three hundred forty-eight thousand dollars. We've got a tipper and a trailer to carry things. We have. We're gonna need arms and a forklift, and maybe a weight. Better picture. Okay. Well, maybe Twitch is just having some issues. Um. Let's see here. But yes, uh, relay day has gone great, except for that like couple minutes there where nothing was working. <laughs> it's been great. Uh, we do have some bugs in the game that they're working on. Um. What did I say we needed? We need a weight. We'll just get a 650. That should be fine. Um, I know. They'll be back. Don't worry about a gaming nerfer. You need a grain bin. I don't think we'll necessarily need the grain bin, but maybe we'll do. Uh, it just keeps the tractor cemented to the ground. So, um, yeah. Well, we had problems for a while. People leave when you have problems. I get it. Uh, they'll be back. No worries. People come back. We're going to buy that. Now it's all working good, so um, I'm going to buy that. And back. There we go. So, can't cast a Chromecast now. Interesting. <laughs> Interesting. I'm back, though, so we're good. Yes, the loyal have stayed and more. Okay, so we're going to get this tractor. Um, we probably should actually buy some horse feed, but we'll come back for it. Um, Yeah, I don't know if that was weather related or if it was just a hiccup and a problem with, uh, let's see, for now we're just going to move. We're going to keep this stuff here at the store because I'm going to come back and I'll need that later. It's all good if, if they don't, that's right. No, they'll be back. People will be back. There we go. Wow, this is a huge, a huge connect. Uh, we are on the German map. This is Brun Fels Brundorf. <laughs> so let's get this onto our farm. Um, hey, what's up, dude? We should probably plow, get a, some plow, like farm implements. Yeah, we're all fixed now. Um, I'm going to ferry this stuff over to the farm. We're just going to be parking outside for now. Eventually we will get it, but... Uh, We'll get a, a cleaner and all stuff, but I, I just need I need to watch how much money I spend. I'd like to be able to get a couple horses and the 
the tack that goes with that. Because I guess the horses can go for quite a bit of money when you raise them up. So, I forgot to turn my beacons on. Too late, we're already here. <coughs> Sorry. Uh, we will be building uh, sheds and stuff like that on the farm eventually. But for right now, we're just doing this. So, we're going to park that there. We're going to get the New Holland Harvester and get this loaded up. Yeah, we're back and rolling. So, don't forget to check tomorrow. Uh, I do three or four sessions a day. Uh, during that time, tomorrow, we're going to be giving away four copies of the PC version of Farming Simulator. I want to make sure I make that clear that it is the PC version. <laughs> uh, there is an autosave function. Yes, Jerry. Oh, no, the weight. Uh, it's going to be right in my way, too. Perfect. I want the weight to stay here, though, but... All right. Yes, but we are all fixed. What's up, Fleetfoot? Welcome back. I've got some coffee. Well, that's getting me some ice water, and I've got cough drops. Oh, this is a really narrow harvester. Yike. So, yes, there is autosave. It's, I have it set to every 15 minutes on this map. I uh, have no idea, you dog man. It just stopped working, so that's all I can tell you. Uh, that didn't work, so we need to go over a little bit this way. <laughs> Yes, you have to buy horse in the animal barns. That is correct. Uh, you actually go into the house and you sleep. The house is your sleeping tool for night, so you don't spend you spend the night sleeping. So we're going to do some missions tonight because we obviously need to make some money to stay in afloat here. But we have more equipment that we need to buy too, so we're just going to set the farm up here. And uh, there we go. It looks really nice. What's up, Hot Rod? I don't know why you think I ignore you, Hot Rod. I don't. <laughs> There's like a million comments going on. I'm trying my best to keep up. Uh, my computer's going down and crashing and everything like that. So, yes, a sleeping option. I don't know if it's available in multiplayer. We have not done any multiplayer yet. Uh, they're still That's still in testing, so I have no idea. Probably, but I don't know. So... Yes, uh, you probably quite asked me. Uh. So we are playing in medium mode, the middle mode, which is you get one point two five million dollars and you start off. Um, the the American map will probably start um, next week. Yeah, it's pretty tight, right? Oh, okay, Derek. Well, there you go. It was Armstrong. That's why we went down because my internet went down. So with the snow, that does happen. People crash into telephone poles and stuff like that. And Oh, it's like a vote, so you can vote to sleep. Okay, that's cool. I'm not sure, uh, Pie Wackets. We're going to try that tonight. We'll find out. Um, yeah, there's really no one to multiplay with yet, but next week we'll be changing that, so we'll find all that stuff out then. Um, absolutely, you dog, man. Let's see. All right, so we're going to jump off here, and I think we still have... We got that other little tipper there, but we're going to leave that for now. Um, hey, what's up, Famous Farming Channel? So we have a problem here. We have a field that is loaded with um, cabbage or sugar beet or something that I don't have a harvester for. Um, sugar beets growing 0%. So we're going to just plow that under. I don't want that. Um, I want to see if we have... I know we have cultiplows, so... Uh, what graphics card do I run? This is a 1060. So, uh, I'm sorry, 1070, not 1060. 1070. Uh, GTX. And it's been totally sufficient. I'll get the controls eventually. <laughs> Uh, well, you saw, Jared, we just started this farm, and I had to buy all the equipment, so you start out with no equipment. It depends on how you do it. Once again, you can, if you play the easiest mode, you start out with equipment, but if you play the other two, the middle two modes, um, then you're going to need to buy all the equipment yourself, so. Uh, I get no lag, so no. The game is silky smooth. It runs at a bazillion frames a second. It's great. No issues with lag. Oh, did you, Hot Rod, did you crash when you got raided? <laughs> did you get raided and crash? I've done that before. 
All right, so this stuff we're going to keep here. Um, yeah, it's pretty gorgeous, isn't it? Yep. Gaming Nerfer, I have no idea. I would imagine it still will look pretty good on a 1050. I would think that they're probably okay. Um, once again, the, this Farm Sim is usually pretty good about being backwards compatible, but you're going to have to look at their compatibility charts. I have no idea. I, I just... I can't, uh, I can't tell you offhand what, what you're going to be missing. So, like as far as graphics. I think it'll probably look good, but I don't know. There we go. We might as well just bring... Well, we're going to leave this here, but I want to get it a little more organized so it's not all over the place. So, there we go. And we're going to drop this off. Sure, Snoop. We're going to hop in there in a minute, uh, and I'll just do that when I get in there. We're not going to be doing too many equipment tours tonight, though. We kind of did all of that today. So uh, I'll do more Q&A sessions probably tomorrow. Um, maybe what we're going to do is we'll switch it around. I'll play this in the morning tomorrow, and then tomorrow night we'll do another, like, free farm um, uh, question and answer session where we just kind of go in and see all the different things that can be seen. And Yes. Let's see, do the sell prices change with the start settings, or is just is just the money and the equipment what you have at the beginning? Just the money and the equipment is what you have at the beginning. You have nothing to sell at the beginning, so uh, from what I found. I don't know about the, the first level, but on the second level, there's no crop, if that's what you're asking. So let's see, people are already back. I told you they'd be back. Here we can customize and repair. We're not doing that right now. I don't want to see what the repair bills are. They're going to be expensive, I'm sure. It would probably be good at some point to buy... Uh, though I didn't, you know, I didn't see an equipment barn. Um, let's see. Oh, yeah, there's a vehicle workshop. Okay, so we do have a workshop, so that will be good. Um, so we wanted to see the bison harvester. I can definitely do you for there. Um, where is the harvester? There we go. Oh, that's right. No, I'm probably not going to stockpile any crop, but, uh, yeah, we probably will uh, at some point need to buy one. So there's the old bison super, and it's... Uh, it's jon it's jonky. It's yonkified. And there we go. Okay, so uh You said 95. It'll keep going up. Alright, so we need to oh <laughs> I forgot to buy stuff. See, this is what happens. People ask me questions. This is why I'm not taking a lot of questions tonight, because I this is what I do. I just get lost when my brain can't handle both at the same time. I have a small brain that can only handle one request at a time. So we need to go to our equipment, and I want to look for a uh, cult of plow. So we're going to go to cultivators, subsoilers. That's the that's what we want. Sweet. We have 175. What's a plebe? A plebeian, like a nor it's like a normal person. A plebe would be like a normal person, like just an average Joe is what that kind of... Pe people out on the street, I guess, would be another way to say a plebe. So like somebody that's not like rich in culture, you know. So do we do Agrisem or do we do the TT? Oh, that needs 240. That's way above our horsepower. So so we'll just do this. We'll do the combi plow. There we go. This is nice because it plows and cultivates in one pass. We need to also look at a cedar. Um, let's see, quarter pass one for you. Oh, man. We'll be back on tomorrow, so I will see you. Have a good night. I think the game is amazing, Schultz. It's really good. Uh, should, should we buy it with Mega? Okay, there's some big ones. We don't have any small sprayers. Dang. That's the smallest one is the Coon Pack, huh? <laughs> wow. Expensive. What's the difference between a subsoiler and a cultivator? The subsoiler plows and cultivates in one pass. Yep, a ordinary person. Thank you. There we go. Yep, slow, slow, middle class. It comes from, I think it's like Roman era is what that comes from. Uh, oh, look at the new Mistar is actually cheaper now. That's cool. And that can actually pleat. You can put an oil seed radish with this. So we're going to do that. <laughs> One potato empire. So that takes care of that. We've got that now. That'll take care of our weeding problem. Hopefully. Um, though I can't think, I don't think we can plant with it, but, uh, let's see what else we got here. Hey, thanks. Thank you for the sub. I appreciate that. 
Uh, we need to get a cedar. Do we go for the User just joined your channel. Amazon? Hey, Mr. Micah. Hello. Mr. Micah is going to help me keep track of all the questions. How big is the biggest subsoiler? I don't know. <laughs> it's a good question. Big. They're not huge. The biggest subsoiler is going to be the one that you got for. Um, I'll show it to you. Um, it's this one, the Agrisim Cultiplow 8 meter. So they're not huge, but because of their size, they require a lot of pull. They, they pull a lot. They require a lot of pulling power. So you need like Big Bud to pull that. Um, this Bednar won't be another good one, but we're just going on the sheep route. So um, yay, new follower. Uh, we are going to get crop protection slash fertilizer in this guy. I guess that we have to do it. I mean, I don't. Okay, so let me look at my equipment haul now. Um, ah, well, it's nice to have you here, man. Thank you. How you doing, Mr. Micah? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Great. How are you? You sound like you've been busy all day. It's been, <laughs> it's been nonstop, nonstop. <laughs> well, I haven't been a little uh, jealous because it feels like torture, but I would love it. <laughs> look, yeah. Happy torture. Look, at you get to play all with them, all the music. That's right. Hang on, you're qu you're kind of quiet, Mr. Micah. Speak am up. Am I now? Go this way. Yeah. How quiet am I? Like, Said, <laughs> so how quiet am I? All right. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab the subsoiler and get out there and just soil the sub. And get a crop planted. Well, if anybody got any game questions, uh, whisper them to me, and then I'll just read them in order to Arthur. Yeah, there you go. Just keep typing in the chat. Mike is going to keep an eye on the chat for the questions, and I'll try to handle some too if I can. But uh, this is the middle game mode that I started on. What do you think so far, Mr. Micah? How do you like it? Um, I have no opinion at this time. No. <laughs> <laughs> well, have you liked what you've seen so far? If we give opinions, are you? Yeah, that's true. No opinions. That's right. If they're good opinions, I think we can say them. I just think it's comparative opinions that they don't want. Oh, okay. <laughs> are you guys able to hear Mr. Mike okay, or do I need to bump him up on the on the mic a little bit? What I can do is this. I'm actually going to go in here. I'm going to turn the game volume down just a second. So... Let's see here. Volume. We're gonna we're gonna put the vehicle volume down to like forty percent. There we go. Okay, Mr. Micah, talk. Talking excessively to make your ears bleed. It's there you go. Job. Mr. Micah is going to get a copy. He already has a copy, yes. Yeah, I like the dynamics yeah, guys. I uh and they look good when you speed up time. They look kinda cool. It's like watching a Japan anime or something. Anime. That's right. And from from what I've from what I understand, um, hang on. So we'll bump up Micah in the in the chat. Hang on a second, guys. Let's see here, Mr. Micah. Yes. What would you like? There you go. Now you're bumped. Thank you, sire. All right. You're welcome, sir. Make sure we're still recording. There we go. Live stream is going. And so. You still need to uh, cultivate and plow. Yeah, you definitely still need to cultivate and plow. Um, but you can switch back and forth. Like, if you use the cultiplow, you don't have to do both, which is nice. You can you can just do it once and have it all done. The downside is it's not as wide as a normal cultivator. Ooh, Maverick. Thank you, sir, for the cheer. Maverick's actually in the lead right now with a thousand. Uh, Sparty's at eight oh nine, and AJ Barry's at six hundred. You guys have done a great job. Now the stuttering that you see is going to be fixed in a patch uh, where the tractor's kind of stuttering as it goes along. They're going to be fixing that. Um, you said, "Ooh, I hear you now, Micah." <laughs> oh, well, thank you. So a two in one, exactly, Adam, and that's why it's a powerful tool. Once again, it's not as wide, but you get it done in one pass, so it makes it a lot more usable, if you will. I can turn these beacons off now that I'm back at home. What do you think of my gorgeous new Holland tractor, Mr. Micah? It's a good-looking tractor. It's like the old one. No, I don't know. It, it's good. Fine. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just a little salty. 
Because you don't have an early release? Yes. <laughs> Mr. Mike is jealous. He said I'm a little salty. <laughs> the uh, You'll notice that it's the new uh, T6 series tractor. It's not the old one. It's got the new grill and everything, so they've updated the uh, the model since the last version of Farm Sim 17 had the old version. So I'm liking this new version a lot better. Now the downside here, you guys, if you want to make your fields bigger with a plow, you have to actually have a plow. You can, the, the culti plow will not uh, make new fields. It'll only uh, plow the fields that you have. So, so this is this is the uh, let's see what game mode did I start in? This is the middle middle mode. So there's three modes. I picked the one in the middle, which is I guess could be considered normal. You start with $1.2 million and um, no equipment. And that works for me. So you can see the tractors are kind of stuttering a little bit. They're going to fix that. So, Yes, I am playing with crop destruction on. That is correct. And from now on, we'll be doing that. So we're going to have to... That's what I'm saying. Eventually, we're going to have to get a vehicle shop. Because when I go... Even before I do much more. So... Because uh, one, because <laughs> once we nope, this is just uh, um, this is uh, sugar beet. So uh, it was already on the field when I got here, but I have I'm not going to rent a sugar beet, waste the money on a sugar beet harvester, because when you lease them, you lose almost as much money as it costs to what you're going to get out of the crop. So we're just going to plow it under, and I think we'll still get a free layer of uh, fertilizer if I'm not mistaken for plowing the crop under. Hey, tell your sister happy birthday, sweet sixteen. Yeah, this is sugar beet. That's correct, JC. Get this going here. Yeah, yeah. You saw that you don't have the game yet. You took the on release date. Well, it's not release day yet. Release day isn't until Monday night, Tuesday for most people. So, um, you do not get damaged running into things, from what I can tell. It's based on usage. The nice thing is you no longer have the overnight fees where you get charged a fee every night. Uh, we just have loan fees. So when you repair the vehicle, does it uh, does all the scratches go away or is that separate? I'm sorry, say that again, Mr. Micah. When as a vehicle ages, they say it can get scratches. So when you repair it, uh, for, let's say the vehicle gets more and more expensive to run isn't that the damage right it just gets more expensive to repair the nice thing is though oh, ha okay. having hours on the tractor don't affect the tractor so i'm going to zoom in here um it doesn't show it as anything on the on the map you can see there there's no lines but it's definitely you lost the crop so uh let's get back out of, out here it is um currently 723 for me um, you know, the, that, that stuttering is being fixed by the developer. That's something that came in this patch. When I was working yesterday, it did not have it, but then we got a patch last night, and they broke something, and so it's stuttering now. Um, so, yeah, the dirt looks good, uh, but, yeah, there's a stuttering that's going on, but that is not something that was in the game yesterday, and it will be gone probably by the next patch. They're saying it may be day one patch, but it might be uh, before, so we're just kind of waiting to see what happens. But there's a known bug with the think tractors and implements sticking to the ground too much. So that's what's going on there. But uh, can I move the camera closer to the dirt? Sure. We can do a dirt inspection. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh, I'm glad to hear that, man. Well, I try my best to interact with people. The good news is right now we're at a size where I can keep up with the comments. Though when it gets really busy, I try to keep up and it gets crazy. So... Uh, yes, they actually will lose power, and they need to be repaired. So as you go, you'll get less horsepower out of the tractor. It won't pull as good, um, and it won't operate properly, so you have to get it repaired. I don't know what kind of damages happen to the tractor aside from horsepower loss, but uh, you are going to have to um, do it. So, yeah, for those of you that are just coming, the graphics are incredible. And I will tell you, Twitch does not do it justice, and even YouTube does not quite do it justice. The graphics are sharp and beautiful and they're just it looks amazing so it, it's it's really it's so much better in real life because i went back to check out the youtube vids and see how they look and i'm like man they don't it just doesn't do it justice so 
Uh, we don't dumb a fly, but I am going to buy the repair shed, and we will get repaired. And once we run the, the tractor for a while, it'll definitely pick up damage. We've already done maybe like 2 or 3% damage to the tractor here, so it, it, it does wear out fairly quickly. So, Well, here's the thing. I've... <laughs> Here's the thing, Adam. I have six children, five of them at home. I'm a single dad. Things explode in my house all the time. I've just gotten used to craziness, so <laughs> I'm pretty chill because it, it takes a lot to get me rattled. Now, my kids will tell you I do have times when I get crabby, but I'm tr I try to... Um... Yeah, am I crabby, John? He said, <laughs> he's, he said I'm crabby when I go to bed because I try to go to bed and then I yell at the kids because they won't be quiet and like go to bed. So after like half an hour of them clomping around, I'm like, go to bed! <laughs> Some people are saying not much of a difference between FS19 and FS17. Um, they haven't played it. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, you're seeing it on Twitch. So. Yeah, I mean, they haven't played it. So I'll just leave it at that. Um, so someone did a repair at 95%. 600 bucks. All right, there we go. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I'm looking at your tractor right now, and the way the sun hits hits the tractor itself is a lot different. Right, exactly. No, it's it it looks different. It, the game definitely feels different. It is not the same as FS17. It's a different game, and it's good. Some things are are kind of the same, uh, but in general, it's a much. It just has a different feel to it. So, uh, that is a bug tailor. Uh, we talked about that a little bit. There's a couple bugs right now. One of them is a distance bug where everything looks green past a certain point. So even if the crop is white, it looks green. They're fixing that. And, um, yeah, it's it. I, I don't know how you could look at this and go, oh, it doesn't look any better, except for the fact that you're watching it on Twitch. but Because Twitch does make it a little bit bad. But, um, but anyway, I try to... I try to uh, so yeah, the stop and go action, once again, the stuttering is a bug. It's a bug that came into the game last night with the current patch, and they are going to uh, fix it. So uh, once again, that's something that they're going to be doing. So I think with hard mode, you're not going to buy a house or anything. You're just going to buy a couple pieces of equipment, and you're going to go right in and start working for people to earn money. So yes, this is going to be the first serious farm. It's going to be on, we're playing on medium right now. So this is my farm, and I'm doing it my way. That's what everybody says. I don't know what that means, but I think Nightbot's working just fine. We're not going to the store, Evelyn. <laughs> Evelyn, can you give me some ice water, please? Please. I'm not going to the store because of that. <laughs> Lime will be uh, periodically like every 3x or 6x. I'm not sure. It depends on what crops you're growing, they said, so I don't know. But, but yeah, this will be my single-player map, and then also if my kids want to join, or maybe me and Micah will play on here, me, Micah, and... Uh, B-Dog or something. Though I know they said that we're, they're going to do Cold Burrow again, so we may do that. Would that sound good, Mr. Mike, playing on Cold Burrow again? I don't think I've ever played Cold Burrow. So, I'd say Weinbach, it feels a little different than the other games. But yeah, I mean, the, the gameplay idea is about the same. So, uh, yes, we're definitely going to put this on YouTube. Yeah, the stutter is making me bonkers. It wasn't doing that yesterday. If you guys watched the videos I made yesterday, it wasn't, it wasn't like that, but now it's starting to do that, so I don't once again, that's a bug that they're going to fix. So, now is that your farm right there you put in? Yes, I built this horse. I built a horse pen because we're going to do horses right away, and I also built the house. And I found there's a pad here on the European map, specifically for building a, a, a homestead. So I decided oh, okay. that was I'd just start with that, and it's somewhat affordable. So we got that. I would like to buy that field next door. Um, so we'll see. Once I'm done getting all the equipment that I need uh, and seed and stuff and have this field seeded, we'll see if we can afford that, and then we'll get it. So, yes, I am on the PC. Yeah. Have you tried to do any crop, creating a crop field at all? Yes, I did yesterday on the, those five videos that I released. I actually grew okay. I grew cotton. So, hey, Sparty guys, thank you for the, chat, for the cheer. Have a good night, buddy. So, um... Nope, the stuttering is with everything right now. That's what they're. That's the 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 bug. That they're gonna work. They're gonna fix that. So, yes, every field needs to be bought separately. You buy land, so you buy the field and the surrounding land. So if you have a tree, you buy the tree, and uh, definitely, we're definitely gonna do a multiplayer series. And every Friday night, we have a, an open multiplayer for everybody. So, yes, definitely like to play realistic. Absolutely. So, yep. If you guys have seen my channel, if you haven't seen the YouTube channel yet, that's where most of the people go to view my stuff. Uh, 
just slide down below the video and there's a link to my YouTube channel. I got about 37,000 subs right there right now and it's doing pretty good. So Older tractors get damage factor. That might be. Yep. That could be because they, they got less horsepower and you got to work them harder. So don't be smart, Alec. All right, Gaming Nerfro, we'll see ya. So the stuttering, once again, is a bug. It'll be fixed by hopefully tomorrow, but I don't know when they're going to be fixing it. They said soon is what they said. So uh, The multiplayer is every Friday night at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Adam. Uh, all the information for joining it's down below. Uh, it says FS17, but those things will still apply. It's going to be about three weeks before it's up, though, because we're just going to... Uh, enjoy doing this. Um, there's one big change, Pi Wackets, to the logging, and that is that you can actually rotate the logs, <laughs> which I've been begging for. So there we go. Gingered Scott, hello. Hey, thanks, Brisket. Welcome aboard, and make sure to check out the YouTube channel. Um, like I said, that's where I post pretty much everything I do on Twitch there also. So if you miss something or you have to leave halfway through. Uh-oh, Micah got bumped. There he is. What happened there, Mr. Micah? Oh, Micah's having some issues. He'll be back. Let's see. That's right. Uh, yes, uh, Taylor, it'll count. The, cult of, the culty plow will count as plowed as along with uh, also cultivated at the same time. So it counts as both. That's cool, Adam. Uh, see, so came from YouTube for... Ah, oh, there you go. Okay, cool. Well, welcome aboard, Mr. Briskets, onto the YouTube Twitch... What would you call it? Mecca. <laughs> uh, what I mean by rotate logs is you used to pick the log up, and the, the direction that you picked the log up was the direction that it stayed. Now you can actually roll the log up, down, left, right, and so you can get it... In, if you're going to try to put a log that you picked up sideways into the tipper, you couldn't do it before. Now, or into a um, grinder... Now you can actually rotate the log while you're holding it. It just rotates and then set it onto the onto the chipper. So that makes a big difference. Mr. Mike, I must have had to run out for a sec. So you said a team meeting. All right, have fun, Merc. We'll see ya. User yes, the, the ground does go in the direction that you work it. Um, so it'll follow whatever you do. Uh, so anyway. There we go. You said you feel like a Backstreet Boy. <laughs> and uh, so my kids are going to get noisy here tomorrow. Uh, yes, I will be on during release day. Probably not as much. Once the videos get, once the game gets released, I, I will definitely need, because I'm going to be streaming quite a bit over the next couple days. Um, I'm going to have to get back to regular life at some point. My car is broken. I'm having, uh, yes, there are bigger subsoilers, but they, this tractor won't pull them. Um, my, my, uh, my car is... Uh, starting to to hesitate when it, when I'm driving it and having a hard time starting and stuff. I think I've got a bad spark plug. So I'm going to go through and replace all the plugs and wires. I got to do that sometime this weekend, so That's right. <laughs> That's right, Taylor. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know. Hey, what's up, Tech Junkie? So, yeah, it's there's going to be a lot of people that want to play. I know. It's okay. I mean, there's a limit to how many people can play. What we might do, too, is if we get enough people, we might just go into, like, two farms of eight. So we can have, like, somebody... We'll have two separate channels on the Discord, and you guys, then we can kind of, like, pop into each other's channels and say, hey, we're coming over to do this, or Harvest Day, so... So, MSC in real life, uh, well, yeah, my son decided... He found out that he's getting, uh, um... Yeah, pretty much... <laughs> Oh, that sucks, Logo. Um, yeah, I, it's okay. We've been live for a short amount of time, about a half an hour. So, um, I hang on. Well, let me let me answer one question at a time. The car is gone. Uh, he's going to sell it. Um, he, he's being he's being deployed to Iraq. This is my son, Mark. Uh, not Iraq to um, um, Qatar next year for six months. And he's like, you know what? He's like, I need the money, and I just can't I can't afford to keep working on the project. So. He's actually selling the Datsun that's going up for sale. It's a 1973 240Z. Needs a lot of work. But it can run. It'll run pretty soon. So That's right. Make sure you follow the channel. Uh, I am not active on Discord. I don't... Uh, I'm a pretty... I'm a I'm, I'm pretty busy guy. Yeah, I hope it's not the ignition coil too, man. Oh. So, uh, um... Yeah. So I don't I, I go on Discord for this kind of stuff. Like when we're playing and we're together, that's how I get people to get on there and play. But I don't 
like hang out on Discord because I actually have a life. I run my own company, and I've got the kids, so I don't just like hang out on there. So anyway, it's uh, yeah, I know I, I'm not super excited about it, but he is. He's wanted to to go overseas, so. Yes, the ground does go the way you work it. Um, that I don't... It should plant... Yeah, if I plant the road sideways, they should go in a, a sideways pattern. Um, yeah, it's a better use of his time, I know. I'm going to miss that car, though, but... I, I live in a state of confusion. <laughs> I live in the Midwest. I've told too many people where I live now, and it's not a good thing. I had one of my viewers today. He's like, oh, by the way, I found your house. Is this your coordinates? I'm like, um, yeah. And he's like... Maybe you shouldn't tell people secret hints about where you live, because I was able to figure it out in about five minutes. <laughs> what do you think about that, Micah? Mr. Micah, are you there? Mr. Micah's silent. <laughs> Maybe he's my invisible friend. <laughs> Let's see. Any improvements on the compatibility? They show you the same thing. It's kind of the same as the last uh, version with that. They show you like what it fits and what it doesn't fit in the store. But um, in general, I'd say no. So I live in chaos. That's right. Uh, yes, it is snowing right now, my friend. Um, a lot. So, yep, Mark is in the Air Force. He ser he's a, a reservist, so he's not full-time. He serves once a week in, or once a month and then gets deployed occasionally. So. Mr. Mike is having some issues there. Um, can you give me a glass of ice water, Ryan? I've asked Goosey like three times now, and she just kind of disappeared. So We have started on the middle difficulty. Um, no, I don't think so. It seems like the hours, hours and usage are what damage your tractor. You can notice that my... my uh, but maybe the type of usage... Maybe it does pull it when it pulls harder. Uh, maybe it goes by RPMs, because you can see here I've already used maybe like 10% of my tractor already. They're right, you dog man. <laughs> yeah, I give myself away all the time, right? Closest 45 degree of the fields? Okay. Yeah, the sounds do. It does sound really good. <laughs> Suburban farmer, easy now. <laughs> uh, 123 Fake Street in Fake, Ohio. Fake, Michigan. Farm manager. Yeah, pretty much I have to be farm manager. I'm going to be farm manager here at home tomorrow. So just so you guys know, it will definitely be a noisier stream tomorrow. My my oldest son uh, at home is 19, and he's leaving for the weekend with his uh, older brother. Uh, Mark and Ryan are going to uh, Philadelphia with Seth to go see to tour some battleships and stuff, which is really cool. Uh, Creatus is going to be joining me, yes. Um Yes, however, the, the hesitation's not good, but they'll fix that. So, uh, Anyway, so they're going to be going for the weekend. So it's going to be me and the three little kids. It's going to be a little bit crazy here. Uh, what I'll do is, uh, Frode, I'm going to plant I'm gonna plant on diagonal just for fun because you guys have been asking. <laughs> so we're going to plant. This is a culti plow, Big Ron, or a subsoiler. What it does is it, it goes deeper than a, a cultivator but not as deep as a plow. So what you end up with is a field that comes up with a plowed state and also cultivated state. And that's good, because that's what you want. Ugh. Tomorrow I will be on and off all day, starting at about 10.30 a.m. Uh, and we'll be going, you know, same thing, probably a couple hours on, a couple hours off, uh, just so I can have a break. Because I do need to, it, I do find that I need a break after a while. I have to stand up and stretch and all that stuff. And so, they have audio issues? Yeah, it's probably Twitch, because I also record for YouTube, and those are always fine, so... So they get all the bugs fixed. That could be, yeah. Here we go. Live in Scotland. Battleships are great. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be cool. Whatever ones are parked in the Philadelphia Harbor is the ones that he's gonna be. Are the ones that he's gonna be seeing. Is the ones he's gonna be seeing. It is currently seven thirty nine. Hi, Mr. Micah. Uh, sorry. He's back. Oh, that's cool. He visited the USS Wisconsin. Why cultivate after plowing? I know, but Snoop, that's not real. In real life, they have to cultivate. You cannot use a cedar on plowed ground. It'll rip it up. So we want to check out real quick. Somebody was asking about seeing the um, 
Step one done. Fifty more to go. Right. Uh, the shop. Uh, seeing the different categories. So we have the track. We have the vehicle category, and it breaks it down into all the different types of vehicles. Uh, I have not gotten the high pressure washer. We'll be getting that soon. Yes. Um, and then we have the implements, and there's a lot of them. There's so much stuff. Yo, you can still cut grass. Yep. Um, they have a really big mower. They've got the big M. Um, uh, there is no riding mower in the game, though. So you have to. It's probably going to come out as a mod eventually. You said, I did not know this. I'm not a farmer. There you go. <laughs> in the game, you can. It lets you do it. But that's bad practice. Uh, and then there's building. So you have the bio bags, bales, and pallets. Let's go back here. Uh, we're going to drop that off. And we're going to pick up the next piece of equipment. which is going to be our cedar. And we're going to get some seed, too. So actually, we're going to put this here. Uh, nope, you can only cut grass on the land that you own. You are not allowed to do anything on land you don't own. So uh, a harrowing implement is going to be the same thing as a cultivator. It it basically power harrows the ground. It spins it around. Um, you want to see those, what they are? They're basically cultivators. Uh, you'll recognize one of them when I show them to you. So... The hair lump of it's like a rake. Yeah, basically like a rake. You'll recognize this coon rake. It basically does the same thing as a cultivator, but in a more active role because it actually, th those black tines or gray tines at the bottom actually spin and they, they stir up the, the, um, the, um, the dirt. And you can use those with a cedar. Usually they have a, a set. So you put the, the cedar behind that. So it cultivates and, and stirs up the dirt, and then the seed goes down into the ground. So, um, yeah, I bought a horse pen. Yep. Yep. So the straw, let's see, straw harvest mix. I hope straw harvest makes it over, too. That'd be great. Uh, no fruit trees. Nope. Um, all right, real trucker. I know. Real life happens. <laughs> Fantastic. You have a great night, real trucker. We'll see you. Osgley's back. Oh, you wonder if the chickens go broody? Well, it says they do uh, reproduce. So, yes. Do we have to refill the def in the tractor? I don't think we have to. Uh, I don't think so. Def is real though, but we don't have to we don't have to we don't have to do it, I don't think. Oh, I just ran that over. 